He's intellectual, queer duck He's homosexual, please don't think that he's perverse He's the patient's favorite male nurse He's okay, he's just fake Cause he's openly gay He's a truly queer, queer duck Queer duck Give me a goose any day That was the best gay rodeo ever! I loved it. Three days of bucking and branding and hog tying. And that was just in the steam room. <laughs> Do you have everything you need? I thought so. Till I met you. He's fine. Boy, George, there's something out on the wing! What is it, a gremlin? Worse, it's Dr. Laura. <laughs> Sweet Christ, what's happening? This bird is going down. Well, since you asked so nicely. Queer Duck, if we survive this, will you marry me? Uh, uh, sure. We're not going to survive this, are we? Mm-mm. Thank God. We made it! Oh, Queer Duck, now we can get married! Well, sure, in theory. If the world was a perfect place, there would be some place where we could get married. There is! Vermont! <laughs> Love, warm as the summer air. Love, stiff as Anne Margaret's hair. My son is marrying a boy, and he's a reptile. A gentile reptile. This is how I always pictured it. The wedding? No, hell. Come on, Estelle. There's one in every family. Right, Uncle Sid? Oh, yes. There's one in every family. It's him, not me. Ho, ho, ho. I, Adam Seymour Duckstein, take you, Stephen Arlo Gator, to be my one and only love. Forsaking all others, unless you're out of town for a week or more, or we have a fight, or you get really, really fat, or, you know, I get drunk at a party and don't know what I'm doing. <gasps> and it really doesn't count as cheating if it's a threesome, or that really cute delivery boy from Zay Bars, or if it's just one part of a man's body coming through a hole in the wall. Amen? Oh, Queer Duck, you do love me! I now pronounce you Adam and Steve. I give it a month. <laughs>